What's up guys and welcome back to G-Rated Family Gaming. I want to talk to you about the five legit, like real actual honest ways to get Robux in Roblox. These are no hacks, these aren't talking about scams, and there's no third party apps. There's actually ways that you can do it that is fair that you're allowed to do this. So let's get to it. Number one clothing sales okay so you guys can actually upload and create your own clothing you can create your own shirts and you can create your own pants via your account or even through your groups uh, if you go to the create tab over here see right here this little create tab in the top you can go to an area in your creations and see this list here there's there's games and there's see shirts there's t-shirts and there's pants with the shirts you can see here you can upload a file and there's a template that you can work on so if you don't have the template you can download it right here you can click it and then you go to the uh, actual template and then from there let's let's see what this looks like we look at this template and this is the t-shirt template you can actually bring this into a drawing program and change it however you want and as long as it's you know family friendly sort of stuff you can upload it and then you can go and price the shirts you can go in here and you can configure the shirts you can configure them and then you can price them in a way that you can sell them as well if you click on sell this item you can price it you lose 30 percent of whatever it is so if you price it at like 10 for instance you will end up getting seven of that and then three of that will go to roblox same thing as far as clothes are concerned you can also upload pants there is another one of these templates that you can ins you can actually pull out and download you can edit that and then you can upload it and you can list that for sale and if people buy it then you can get 70 percent of the robux that they spend on that so that is the first way that you can actually get this the second way that we want to talk about here is the economy in roblox there are all these items and you can buy and you can sell and you can trade so as far as buying and then selling sometimes these limited items for example let's take a look at this beast mode when it first came out it was a hundred it was a hundred robux so a bunch of people were able to buy this when it came out for a hundred robux five thousand people were able to do that and then they turn around and they sell it so you, they can take these items that they own and they can sell them if you have a limited or a limited you you can have the option to do that for example I have this DIY Dominus Imperius I'm not sure what I bought it for it was probably like close to three thousand but it's gone up in price now what people are willing to sell it for so I can come in here now that I own it, instead of wearing it, I can go to sell and I can sell that. So I could price this thing at like 50,000, you know, and then it shows that 30% will go to Roblox, of course. But if I sold this for 50,000, then I would get 35,000 Robux out of that. Now you have to understand that how much you price it is going to depend on whether people are going to buy it because there's probably people that are pricing it lower. So it is a uh, an economy thing. If I went and I priced this thing at one Robux, it would be sold really quick and that person could turn around and they could probably sell it for a lot more than that. Uh, so this is basically how you do that. You can successfully place things on sale. So I put that thing on sale, but for 35,000 Robux. Nobody's going to buy that thing at that price, but this is just an example of how you can make some money through the economy. Another way with items is that you can do trades. Sometimes you have an item that you got at one price, and then people want to trade it to you for another item that's more valuable. Now you can accept or not accept trades. Uh, this trade right here is kind of close in value. It's about 1,600 in value to what theirs is. So this is kind of a decent trade but sometimes you can trade up in a way that you can earn Robux through the items that you've got. You can actually say you've got an item that's 1,600, you trade it for something that's 1,700, and then maybe that item goes up or you want another item, but you can actually make some money by trading up in the trade system. The third way that we'd like to talk about is becoming a developer. Guys, if you can create games in Roblox, you can get a lot of Robux. There are so many different ways that you can do that. If, if you download Roblox, you're also downloading Roblox Studio. And via Roblox Studio, you can come in and there's there's all these templates. You can create things that you want. Here's like an obby template. We can go in there and we can make the changes. This platform takes a quite a while to learn. There's a lot about building. There's a lot about scripting. And there's a lot of stuff going on here. But if you take the time to learn, Learn. there's a lot of resources that are available to you and you can create games that have things where people can buy stuff for example if you want to have VIP passes if you want to have people pay Robux to skip a level if they want in-game funds like in jailbreak people can spend Robux and they can get jailbreak money or they can usually earn it you know through playing the game but a lot of people can give the option for you to actually just buy the in-game funds people can buy badges they can buy in-game items they can buy VIP servers and they can buy things like special extra 
powers in games. There's so many different ways that you can offer people, you know, cool power-ups or whatever inside your game that they can spend Robux on, and then 30% of that goes to Roblox, and 70% of that goes to you. So making games, definitely, like I said, it takes some time, but there are a lot of resources. If you go to this Create tab, if you scroll down, you can see here, Developer Resources. You've got documents here that are available. You can click on the documents, and they can show you all different aspects of it from the very simple to very complex there are different links in here that you can click on from these documents and they will take you through every little aspect of roblox studio and learning what you need to learn and there's also a lot of other resources that are available online and on youtube people like alvin blocks who can teach you how to do scripting and that kind of stuff so if you can become a developer you have a lot of potential to earn a lot of robux through this and not only robux you can actually earn real money that was right. Believe it or not, some people have gotten rich on Roblox. They can develop games, the games can get really popular, and then they have this thing called Developer Exchange. There's an FAQ on some questions about Developer Exchange, but basically what it comes down to, you can take, say, you've earned 100,000 Robux through your game, you can exchange that for 350 US dollars. Like, I know some developers that are sitting on over 10 million Robux, and they can ex exchange that for over $35,000. So this is a legit way that you can actually make this a job. If you become a game developer and you become really skilled, and you get games that people are playing then you can make a lot of robux and you can make a lot of real money as well and it is totally legit the fourth way I'm going to talk about is kind of a special way this is kind of a way that I tend to get ro robux myself but you can become a content creator or an influencer in some sort of way for example I have a YouTube channel that you guys are watching right now with about 50,000 subscribers at this point and sometimes developers they will contact me for example Packstabber you know hey would you like to play my game and promote it and then if you promote for a developer they can actually pay you through their groups in robux so it's basically you're offering them a service you're providing them a service and they're paying you through robux so if you become a content creator in roblox and you have some influence and you can help to expose their game it's you know it's like advertisement for them they're gonna have to pay for it one way or the other which you can actually do inside of roblox and roblox roblox studio you can spend some of your robux to advertise inside the roblox site like if you go to the Roblox site, see this advertisement here? There's an advertisement here. People can actually spend their Robux to do that to advertise their games to get them more popular. So that is the fourth way to get Robux legitimately. Now the fifth and I'd say the last and the least way to legitimately get Robux is to just buy them. This is the only other legit way to do it. Uh, if people are saying we're going to give you free Robux, they might be trying to scam you, trying to hack you. Don't fall for those. Don't give any of your personal information to anybody. Uh, don't believe any of those hypes that people are going to give you free Robux, and I wouldn't even go to any of those sites. If you see like the flame.gg or the ro robux.com, and you go there and you have to watch things and you have to, you know, uh, download apps and you have to do advertisements, uh, you gain points and you exchange those for gift cards, you never know what you are downloading, and you could be downloading something on your system that is going to steal your information and hack your computer. So I would recommend staying away from those things. Okay, guys, so that is it. Those are the five legitimate ways to get Robux in Roblox. Make sure that you don't go with any of the non-legitimate methods because you're putting yourself at risk, and there is a lot of potential for you to actually get a lot of Robux and to actually get some real money through exchanging that Robux for the U.S. currency. I hope this has been helpful for you guys. Make sure if you're new here to subscribe and hit the notification bell on the way out. Thank you for watching, and we will see you guys later. Bye.